like to paint uh, children. Uh, some people say they're creepy children. I found a box of stained glass supplies in a house I was working on, and that's kind of how we got started. I love it when I am somebody's remembrance of Savannah. That's the really cool thing about doing jewelry as well. My art is all over the world now. I paint a lot of coastal, uh, tabby, and I like to paint historical Savannah things. A lot of people call it pop surrealism because usually I like to put a little element of pop culture in. It is quite a lot of time involved because each step is its own process. You've got to be true to yourself and find your own style. There's a group of us and we do shows at the Homewood Suites Hotel and the Doubletree Hotel. As a working artist, and this is being my full-time job, it is a hustle. It is a hard way to make a living. Everybody thinks, oh, you're just at home painting. You can make the most beautiful pieces in the world, but if they don't sell, you're not going to be able to support your art. It's wonderful to have an opportunity to show your work. It, it's fun to meet the people and yeah, it gets sure. to learn about where they came from and why they come to Savannah. The art shows that I do, there's always an entrance fee, there's always tables to buy, tents to buy, so it's just really refreshing to come here and be um, able to set up and show my work to a lot of people that would not get to see it from all different parts of the country. It's just a really special feeling.